Hi there. Thank you for stopping by to share with Julie today. I hope you're having a fantabulous day today. In this video, I am looking at Colonel Marvin Hoggart. Um, you know, one of my viewers has asked me to look at Colonel sometime now, actually. Um, that was one, one of the items he asked me to look at and I promised I would. So now it's cola nut time. And cola nut, of course, we know it as busy in Jamaica. Yes, busy, 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 busy. I mean, we grow up with busy, drinking your busy tea. If you, um, especially when I was, um, when I was um, a child, and it's usually, um, you know, my mom or my dad, you know, if you get a cut, um, especially if it's something, if you get probably like a cut with, um, from some, a zinc or an old nail or something like that, you know, then they would use busy, sometimes combining it with other things and tie it onto the area that you would get, that you got the cut because they would tell you that it pull, it, you know, it pull um, anything that is not supposed to be there. It pulls it out and prevents infection. And we would also drink the tea. They would grate the busy, you know, and use it to make tea. So that's my experience with um, with busy growing up. So, but I've compiled some information. So. I hope you guys will find it useful. Cola nut, also known as Bissy. Cola nut is the fruit of the cola tree. It is not the fruit of just one particular tree, but rather any species of tree of the cola genus. So in fact, cola nut is the fruit from any of these trees of the cola genus. Example, cola acuminata, cola gigantea, cola clavata, cola nitida, among others. The information provided here references the cola acuminata and the cola nitida, but primarily the cola acuminata. Scientific name, cola acuminata. Common names include bisi, cola nut, and guru nut. Where is it found? It is indigenous to the African rainforest and generally found in tropical climates. The cola nut has a bitter flavor. Cola nuts macro and micronutrients include Potassium, calcium, iron, magnesium, sodium, and phosphorus. Its key constituents are caffeine, theobromine, tannins, and phenolics. Medicinal uses. It is generally used for stomach pains, as a purge or detox, as an antidote against poison, usually food poison, as a tonic to energize and strengthen the body, for dysentery, to allay hunger or suppress appetite. Cola nut is also a cognitive booster, improving cognition and concentration due to it increasing the levels of oxygen in the brain. It is put on cuts to promote healing. It is usually chewed before meals to help promote digestion. It is often used to treat whooping cough and asthma. Cola nuts are also chewed to treat morning sickness and prevent migraines. It has a stimulant effect on the central nervous system and heart due to it containing caffeine and theobromine. Cola nut is also traditionally used for menstrual cramps, urinary tract infections, jaundice, gout, diabetes, congestive heart failure, hepatitis, venereal diseases, as well as rheumatism. 
Let's look at the scientific studies. A 2004 study showed that it inhibited the growth of certain bacteria and fungi. There was also indication that only a small quantity of the extract would be required to impair bacterial growth. In a 2009 study of mice, it was found that when cola nuts were added to their meal, they ate less compared to mice who did not have cola nuts added to their meals. In comparison, the mice whose meals had cola nuts added reduced body weight significantly over the 28-day period. This indicates that cola nut could be effective for weight loss. Preliminary studies found that Bisi extract has the ability to eradicate prostate cancer cells by inducing cancer cell death in an apparent AR-dependent manner. In 2014, a study was published in Advances in Biological Chemistry suggesting that cola nut shows promising results against microbes surpassing the effects of antibiotics. They further concluded that cola promises to be an effective anti-cancer, antimicrobial, and chemopreventive agent. Experiments also showed that cola nuts stimulate the secretion of gastric juices, thereby having the ability to aid digestion. Who shouldn't use cola nuts? People with stomach ulcers, since it increases gastric juices. Insomniacs, due to the stimulant effect of the caffeine. It should also be kept away from pets. The theobromine in cola nut can be fatal to pets because they metabolize it much more slowly than humans. Also, patients taking medications for anxiety or depression should seek consultation before taking cola nuts. Cola nuts and colas. It is interesting to note that cola nut was used as a flavoring agent in many sodas, hence these being referred to as colas. The most popular being Coca-Cola, which no longer contains cola nut. It is important to note that the properties of all cola nuts are not identical. In phytochemical and antimicrobial studies of four species of cola, cola acuminata, cola gigantea, cola nitida, and cola milleni, the findings showed that the effect of plant extracts on growth of bacteria and fungi varied depending on the species of cola. In the study, it was concluded that even though all the species studied had effects against bacteria and fungi, the cola acuminata and cola gigantea were more effective at fighting bacteria and fungi, even at low dosages. Phytochemical analysis also showed that cola acuminata has more alkalides, tannin, and saponin than cola nitida. On the other hand, cola nitida seeds contain slightly more caffeine than cola acuminata seeds. Also, cola nitida is more astringent than cola acuminata due to its higher phenolic content. So in general, the actions of the cola nuts are similar. However, some properties are more pronounced in some species than others. It can be taken internally or used externally. It is usually chewed fresh, grated, or used in powder form. It is also used to make tinctures. Cola nuts are important in many African societies, particularly West Africa. It is often used in rituals, and offering the cola nut is a gesture of friendship and hospitality. I will also be adding some information on the resources page of the italisvital.info blog so you can check that out also.
so there you have it guys i hope you found that useful subscribe to my channel like and share my videos don't forget be the change you'd like to see in this world have a fantabulous day today ta-ta